All right, guys, so yeah, currently it's like six o'clock right now and they just, uh, yeah, they started about an hour ago. And yeah, I left Bamba there until like one o'clock. But what I want to talk about is since you got three puppies, I want to make a bet with Calvin what the colors are going to be. So what do you think the colors are going to be? Fawns. Fawns? Okay, so how many fawns? How many fawns, how many whatever? Two, two fawns and one whatever color. Two fawns and what, what? Cream, I think. Cream, okay. So I think I'm gonna say probably one fawn and two creams at least, so. And I don't know, let's see who's right, so. I wanna bet 50 bucks on that? Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you. Who's going to win the bet, pretty much, because I'm curious, because when we mix a try with a brindle, uh, actually, try can actually kill the brindle color, too. It, it negates, it can negate brindle, but we never know, because you only need one copy of brindle to get a brindle, so it could be that, too. But since Roach doesn't carry brindle, because he's a try, obviously, we're going to see that. So, all right, guys, I'll see you next part and see who wins the bet. Or we might, we not, might not win at all, so honestly, so, all right, guys. Hey guys, so yeah, just uh, currently it's been a couple of days now since I've been with these puppies. And yeah, I think they were like, what, three days now after uh, the C-section with Bamba. And they are so badass. Forgot to show you guys, but here, surprise, not surprise. Boom, baby. So, if you guys didn't know, I actually lost a damn fucking bet. I lost a bet, so 50 bucks to Calvin. <laughs> Congrats, Calvin, little bastard. Oh yeah, look at that. It's a boy right there. Ooh, he is a big toad, bro. Look at that toad. You see that dome on his head right here? Look at that dome right there. He's a toad, man. Fat. Short and stubby. It's crazy. I never had a litter like this compared to the other ones with Missy. It just tells you how much of a difference uh, your female... Um, you know, it, it matters with the mom as well and i guess obviously with bamba it clicks better and uh, even though bamba doesn't have color it just clicks better and boom it just shows more of the characteristics of uh, you know the dad and the mom together it's crazy you know and bamba throws out some crazy ass shit too so i was wondering you know if i throw those two together you know what'll happen but y'all this is crazy here i'll show you the real colors right now Damn. <laughs> but hey, ain't nothing to guarantee yet before, you know, after th like three weeks of these pups, you know? So you never know. This one's a red fawn. Red fawn female right here. And then I'll show you guys this guy again. The toad right here. It's uh, the fawn. Fawn male right here. I think black mass. Could be possibly black, black mass. But damn. These guys are badass and... I'm gonna give Calvin 50 bucks in a bit because <laughs> I lost a damn fucking bet. He even forgot about it, but I'm mad at my word. I give him the 50 bucks because, uh, as you guys remember, I, you know, I bet for two creams and one fawn, but uh, I forgot to tell you guys too, as well, that um, uh, actually, at, so Calvin betted two fawns and then one cream, but I still lost anyway. So, uh, what actually happened with the third, uh, puppy is that it was it was actually a cliff palette you know guys I, I forgot to i didn't forget i just didn't want to uh, record the puppy you know just for its uh just for its sake and uh yeah it, it was it sucks you know and uh it was a it was a cliff palette and uh its whole mouth was that this whole mouth was actually structured but then we look at the like upper palette uh -huh, it's like like a line all the way through and then uh, dr bill was actually telling me you know if i was to actually raise this you know i would have to do two feeding as well of everything and probably possibly feed it every like hour and half or so but dude it was so small guys and these guys are like what nine eight ounces when they were born too and i'll show you guys the weight right here man they're they they were they're pretty big already and uh, compared to uh missy's leaders too man because um Mrs. Litters, I was dealing with, uh, with fading puppy syndrome, and yeah, they, you know, these guys pretty much weigh the same as them. But now that Missy's uh, pu puppies are doing better now, obviously they weigh more now. So it's it's once you like hit over that obstacle, like they climb over that obstacle of the disease or their sickness, then boom, they start spiking up in the weight. So yeah, Missy's doing it really good now, and hopefully these guys do as you know as great too. I don't want anything to happen to these guys. 
and it, you just don't want to have that in the first place anyway you know even though i know how to you know deal with it you just don't want to do it you know i just don't want to do sub cues if you don't have to but if you have to you have to you know so yeah the the cliff palette man it was only like four ounces and it was crazy and literally when she brought it in with like in the car to me it literally just died on the spot and uh, yeah it was like it was just cold and limp and it was it was just dead and then she asked me you know and she was like would you want me to dispose and i say you know yes please you know yes man you know i, I didn't want to have it you know and i don't know what to feel bad or nothing at all but i just didn't want it you know <laughs> i don't know it, it just felt weird to you know to have it so I don't know. Uh, tell me what you guys think. You know what I should have done, honestly, or, or or what would you guys do in you know if you guys were in my spot? So, yeah, that's uh, I could have had three puppies, but the third puppy was actually a Cliff Palette. Um, pretty weird, even though I gave folic acid too. So maybe it just it just happens, you know, not inbred or nothing at all. It just happens, you know. As you guys see, they're perfectly healthy and stuff like that. So, all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoy that content and yeah, like and subscribe and yeah, um, yeah. So this is. Damn, it's litter. Uh, the second litter already, and <sighs> gonna be taking these care of these guys for two weeks, and then hopefully I'm gonna open up uh, Missy's uh, litter up for uh, for sale soon. So, I right, guys, love you guys so much, and yeah, peace. Here we go, go.